So you've learned how to write a claim for an argument, but we should now turn our attention to writing an effective claim. Writing effective claims should be pretty simple. You only need to obey three rules. So, how do you write an effective claim? The first rule is to write in the affirmative. Writing in the affirmative means that you are not using words like not or never in your sentence, such as this example. Schools should not censor students. Make sure to write a sentence that avoids words like not or never. Instead, you could write something like this. Schools should allow their students freedom of speech. That way, you are creating a positive impression. Affirmative and positive statements are always more effective than negative ones. Write in the affirmative. Second, Write a controversial opinion. No one wants to listen to an argument that is not controversial. No one wishes to listen to an argument that everybody already agrees with. Write an opinion that stimulates debate and controversy. Schools should provide education to children is not controversial. You want to make sure to take this idea and make it controversial by changing it in some way. Schools should provide free lunches to all students would be controversial. It sounds a bit like a silly opinion. However, it is better than the original because it is controversial. Once you write something that is controversial, you'll find it easier to research and easier to expand upon. Third, and finally, be specific. Being specific usually involves the action. If you have a responsible agent and you've used the word should, an action like this is not very specific. Schools should fight bullying. Of course, you realize that that may be a violation of the second rule, the controversial call. However, this is also a violation of this third rule, being specific. So, we will eliminate it and write something much more specific. Schools should promote positive reinforcement policies to reward kind behavior. Is this controversial? Perhaps because it emphasizes positive over negative reinforcement, and that's always controversial. However, we're focusing here on specific. My claim now focuses on a specific course of action to fight bullying. Why would I do this? It seems overly complex and wordy. However, it's much easier to write this. Schools should promote positive reinforcement policies to reward kind behavior helps me focus my argument on a specific course of action. It makes my writing easier to research and easier to express. To review, writing an effective claim only requires three reminders. Write in the affirmative, write a controversial opinion, and write specifically. If you have followed the rules for writing a claim in the first place, using a responsible agent, the word should, and an action, then you proof your claim for these three rules you should write a claim that is not only logically intact, but effective and can lead an excellent argument.